Hey, 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 what up, people? It's PJ Nugget 333 and here's the second episode of Nerd Talk, so let's get started. Okay, so first off in um, video game news, we have Watch Dogs has a release date for May 27th. If you're excited for that, comments down below. I will give more info about that. Links in the description. Also, has PS4 beaten Xbox One? Well, the answer is yes. In um, PS4 has beaten the Xbox so far. It's beating it 2-1. to one. Um, the sales is, is crazy. It's beating it by so much. Um, so if you want to check that out, links in the description. Um, yeah. Another late story by, uh, a late by a few days. Um, Dishonored 2 info has been leaked. It's nothing, nothing's confirmed, but some Dishonored stuff has been leaked. Dishonored 2, so I haven't really played the first one, but if you're interested in that, links down below. Another not so big story, but, um, Titanfall, when you get the game for Xbox One people, you're going to need an 840 uh, megabyte update when you get it uh, before you play, so there's another story. But not least in video game news, um, Bungie ha may have confirmed, well, it's not confirmed, but may have rumored spe speculation around um, the, uh, the Destiny beta coming out in eight weeks. Um, in their last weekly update, they, um, they gave hints about the beta coming in eight weeks, so it's like two months, it's going to be coming soon. Um, links for that down below, um, and no link for the Titanfall thing, because that's not really important, but yeah. For gaming news today, moving on to movie news. First news story for movies, it looks like Chris Evans, the guy who plays Captain America, is going to be signing off and going to be uh, done with the Avengers movies, um, after Avengers 2, and Scarlett Johansson is pregnant, so it's also going to be hard for her to do the Avengers, so it looks like the Avengers is falling apart right now, which isn't very good, but links to that will be in the description. So if you didn't know, Jesse Eisenberg was cast as Lex Luthor a few weeks ago, so the cast for Man of Steel 2 isn't looking very good, so we got Jesse Eisenberg as Lex Luthor. Luther and Ben Affleck is Batman, so it's not not good casting choices so far. But anyway, um, Brian Cranston was also going to be cast as Lex Luthor, but then Jesse Eisenberg took the role, and then Brian Cranston just announced that he would have taken the role if Jesse Eisenberg hadn't come in. So looks like Jesse Eisenberg stole the role from Brian Cranston, and I think, in my opinion, Brian Cranston would have been great. But now that's over. So ugh. If you haven't heard, The Last of Us video game is getting a movie release with Sam Raimi, the guy who did the Spider-Man movies in uh, 2000, like early 2000s. Um, he's getting cast to direct it, or he's he's directing it, and right now everybody's having trouble finding out who should be Ellie, so um, that news should be released soon. Box office and movie releases are the same thing with um, Mr. Peabody and Sherman and um, Grand Budapest Hotel <coughs> and... Um, 300 Rise of an Empire, and with DVD releases is Hunger Games Catching Fire, so that's new. You can go check that out on DVD. For movie releases, everything I talked about will so far will be in the links in the description, and now moving on to TV news. If for TV, the only news it looks like we have today is um, director of Gravity, Alfonso Cuaron, is turning to TV to, I think, produce the show Believe, or, yeah, I think that's what it's called. Yes, Believe, and he's also working with J.J. Abrams, so that's pretty cool. That will be in the description. Um, everything I talked about, links will be in the description, except for the Titanfall stuff, it's not very important. Um, we didn't have a lot of TV news today, so I'm going to recommend a TV show, and my TV show recommendation today is GHS Video Game High School. Um, season 3 is going to be coming out soon. Um, it's a good, it's a web series. Um, it's on Netflix, it's directed by Freddie, Freddie Wong, he's a pretty good, pretty cool guy. Um, so it's a, it's a fun show. Go watch it. That's it for today. See ya when other news comes out. Bye.